This is Laura Walker and I am transforming a piece of thrift store art. It's a printed panel and turning it into an original piece of art with adding an animal. I'm starting with the eyes of this fox and like to do my shading and details on the eyes before I continue to the rest of the painting. I'm using artist grade acrylics. And now I'm doing the inside of the ears applying the white paint and then while the acrylics are wet I'm adding in some black wispy hair shading. I am using Gaffrey art material for my thick um, textured acrylics. I used to use oils but they would take forever to dry and then they would shrivel after like eight or nine months of drying. Gaffrey holds its shape and will be dry. Um, overnight get a skin on it overnight if there's a fan on it thoroughly dry within a week or two <clears throat> so i'm piping it directly the paint directly to where i need it and doing a little bit of shading as i go and adding the lip wasn't quite sure uh, what the story was with this fox yet but he's starting to take shape by now looks a little disgruntled the way that mouth went on a little sideways and and I'm just kind of glazing black over for his nose. Uh, you can wipe it over the paint that you're using. Gaffrey Art Material will work with regular acrylic paints. So now I'm adding my red with a palette knife, I'm using a larger palette knife to get it on there, and then a brush and my smaller palette knife when I need to um, integrate it or make it go up next to the flatter areas or more detailed areas like for the eyes. Now I am texturing it. The way that the fur grows is the texture that I'm doing. And <clears throat> wanted to make the nose area come out farther. So I added it after doing the flatter areas. And I used old guitar strings for his whiskers. I uh, get those from my dad's music store. I just really love using different recycled elements. But I'm adding in those whiskers there. And at this point, he started reminding me of Ash from the fantastic Mr. Fox. So once he dried, I did some shading to make him look more Ash-like. And just do a more detailed.